Hi guys, Matthias with another quick uh, tutorial for uh, Trimble Business Center. Now, I know I read some comments here a few years late, but uh, I think that was a great idea. So the question was how to rotate uh, objects, uh, you know, lines, points, whatever, by a given angle, right, around uh, origin point, let's call it, right? So let's dive right into it. Uh, let's create a couple of points. So point one, I'm going to go and say, I'm going to zoom in a little bit. Uh, point one is going to be our origin point, right? Uh, then we're going to do like, let's say one point here, one point here, another here, one point here. Uh, next step would be maybe uh, draw a line what i want to do is i'm going to draw one line to the origin so we can uh, figure out the angle right and test it out and then let's say one line between three and four uh, maybe from five to snap to the middle point uh, you know like like that and let's let's put a circle there you know something whatever right so now we have our um, our objects which we want to rotate and let's say we want to rotate them uh, about 15 degrees uh, counterclockwise okay so the way to do it is you undercut uh, ribbon go to rotate right select objects so i'm just going to select these objects because all, all i want to rotate remember this line is just for a reference right i'm gonna choose my origin point right this one and as you can see because i have enabled dragging i'm already basically rotating it right now if this is my zero if i want to rotate it clockwise it's a positive number if i wanted to rotate it counterclockwise it's a negative number so as i said i have a 15 degrees which I want to rotate, right? So I'm just going to hit the tab. So as you can see, it already translated it by 15 degrees, right? Now this is clockwise, as you can see. If I go negative 15, this is going to be counterclockwise, right? And I just hit apply. And as you can see, it had moved it. Now, to figure out whether we did this correctly I'm gonna just go to measure measure angle and I'm gonna go from my initial point to my pivot point and to my point number two it measured the angle of 15 degrees so as you can see this is how you can rotate objects on a origin point, pivot point, pivot point, or whatever you want to call that on a certain angle. Okay guys, so here you have it. Uh, this is how you rotate the uh, objects based on the origin point and defined angle, right? So thanks for watching, hit subscribe, and uh, we'll see you at the next video.